Well, for the first time in more than 20 years, thousands of people will gather in Wichita for a tattoo convention. It took a change in city laws, though, to make it happen. Cake's Jocelyn Schifferdecker spoke to the men behind it all. I'm very passionate about tattoos and the art of it. Um, honestly, it's something that changed my life. Brian Parsons is a tattoo legend in Wichita, the owner of Addictions and in Ink. He's been doing tattoos for 25 years, and he has a dream, bringing tattoos to be the mainstream in Wichita. A lot of people would distance themselves amongst people that are heavily tattooed now. Some people don't even bat an eye at it. So we're trying to uh, continue that image. For 10 years, he's been wanting to have a huge tattoo convention at Century 2. He was telling his client and local event coordinator Steve Roseberry about it last August in this very room. Ever since then, the two have been working to make it a reality. Him and I just, as I was getting tattooed, just started dreaming and brainstorming and bringing, you know, bringing this to fruition in our minds. But there was one problem, a city ordinance that bans tattoos in the Central Business District. Parsons and Roseberry refused to give up on this dream, though. We first reached out to uh, Maggie Ballard with the city council to try to amend some of the zoning for Century 2. Tuesday, the city council unanimously decided to change the zoning law, giving the expo a green light. Feels great. <laughs> Trying to work on this for 10 years, feels great that it's finally about to happen. The River City Tattoo and Lifestyle Expo is still in the beginning stages, but Parsons and Roseberry can't wait to see their planning come to life. We're going to have a lot of contests on different categories of tattoos. Uh, we are going to have tattoo artists working, cosmetologists, barbers, and many other vendors. In Southwest Wichita, Jocelyn Schifferdecker, Cake News on your side.